Hello everyone, it is Susan here, and welcome to Hashtag Tag Tuesday. It is a open collaboration hosted by Sherry from Turquoise Dreaming. I will have her link below. Please head on over there and give her some love, and um, she'll have the link to um, the participants YouTube channels in her description box, so make sure you check them out. Today, the tag I'm going to work on is actually a piece of canvas. And I have like some little, little, I don't know, little pieces and um, like a button, a little piece of a metal charm and just stuff. I want to do some slow stitching on this tag. And my plan for this tag is I'm going to, well, this is what I'm thinking right now. I am going to put this tag, not today, on my next wall hanging that I'm doing. And I'm using this um, linen napkin for that. So I know I want this wall hanging to be, um, have a lot of black in it. And so I'm gonna put a lot of black in this tag or on this tag. And um, yeah, yeah. So I'm making it for a purpose. And I kind of like that. <laughs> I don't always do that. I do have my threads here. I'm ready to roll. I mean, I was playing around with these fabrics just a little bit. I don't know, you know, you just kind of do it. And when it looks nice to you, then you know you have it right. Um, what I have noticed with slow stitching is that, um, I don't know, I end up changing things quite a bit. Like, it's like, oh, I have this plan, I have everything laid out, and then I change it anyway. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's kind of how I've been rolling with this. But, you know, I don't want to add to too much. Um, I like that so far. I think that that's a good combination. Um, you know, maybe I'll get that on first, and then we can figure out what to do next. I kind of like that actually. So maybe that's something that I'll do. I also have these little pieces here. I decided to go ahead and speed it up. Otherwise it was, the video was gonna be a, a bit too long. So I have selected the fabric and I'm just gonna put one pin in it just to keep everything in its place. And the yarn that I selected is a beautiful mustard color. So I like it because it um, is a contrast to the fabrics that, that I'm using. Um, and sometimes I really enjoy having the yarn um, really pop and um, show up you know, very easily on my projects. And sometimes you'll see that, you know, I like the yarn to blend in. You know, it all depends on the look that you're going for um, on that project or, you know, on that piece of fabric. So you'll see that I do, you know, cut a little bit out of this because <laughs> I didn't think that you needed to watch every single stitch that I made. Um, but I do want to keep some of it in because, uh, yeah. Oh, and right there, right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I messed up. So I went, you know, underneath the fabric instead of from the top of the fabric. And it created that little piece that went around the side of the tag. And that's okay. I think I have done that honestly in every single slow stitch 
project I've worked on so far. Honestly, I really do think so. <laughs> so I'm going, it's like my signature at this point, right? <laughs> I don't know. I kind of, I guess, get lost in in the stitching and I forget, am, well, am I going from the top down or am I going from the back up? Sometimes I just forget and yeah, and that happens. And I just kind of roll with it. I do, I do. Um, so I'm liking the way that this is looking so far. And I just moved a little bit forward again here. And I'm going to get these last few uh, pieces down here. And uh, yeah, and this is the very last of the stitching. And you'll see that I do struggle with this needle a little bit because, well, it has a blunt tip to it. And this canvas that I'm working on is, well, it's just hard to get the needle through. So, yeah, but I, I did it. I mean, it worked. It worked. Now I'm just trying to figure out placement, just playing with all these little pieces. And... I don't know. I ended up going with something totally different <laughs> than what I thought I was going to. So I'm going to just pull out a little bit of lace right here. And this lace was not the right piece of lace. It just, it has like a shine to it, like a shimmer. And it just wasn't right. But I had this little piece in my happy box and I folded it and you could still see the pretty yellow yarn underneath and the, the color of the fabric underneath it. So I'm like, you know what? That gave such a soft touch that that bottom piece I have on there right now, I just took off. It was just way too heavy. So all I'm going to do with this lighter color thread is just, well, I basically did a, a, a basting stitch on that, uh, on the right side of the lace and you'll see I do another basting stitch on this left side like right here because all I'm trying to do is just get that lace to stay there um and I don't I don't know I don't want the yarn to to be a thing over there I want it to be all about the the lace right there um now we need to get this charm on here this charm is super cool I had it in my stash. It is actually looks like a, a pewter charm. And, you know, it has the heart and it has like two little balls on it. I don't know. It's just super pretty. Um, and somehow like that, that what I want to call a heavy looking charm works so well with that really pretty lace. They just pair together nicely. So that is done. I like leaving all of the little pieces of frayed edges. You know, it's like a bit of a mess and that's okay. So I, again, I'm not doing this today, but just kind of to show you, uh, let me zoom back out. Kind of what my thought process would be on this. So like this tag could end up being the focal point on this slow stitched wall hanging. So something like that. That's what I'm thinking. So Sherry, thank you so much for this collaboration. This was a ton of fun. I really enjoyed it. I love the way that my tag came out. I didn't make too much of a mess on the back. Kind of neat. Um, yep. So let me know if you have any questions. Hop over to see Sherry and the rest of the channels. All right, thank you all so much for being here. Have a blessed week. Bye-bye.